time for part two of our sister holiday tag. Mm -hmm. We talk a lot. We have to split it up into two. <laughs> and there are a lot of questions that we want to answer. So let's get started. Round two. Round two. 18. Can you name all of Santa's reindeers? Glitzen. Glitzen. Darn. Dan no, it's Dancer. Dancer, Prancer. Dancer, is Prancer. Is it Dancer or Prancer? It's is Dancer. It's Dancer and Prancer. I think it's just Prancer. Blitzen. Blitzen. Rudolph. Rudolph. Well, Rudolph does not count the first original eight. Um, did we say Comet? No, we did not. Comet. You're Comet. good. Comet. Yeah. yeah. Mm. We fail. <laughs> I should look that up. Failure in life. Okay. Um, 19. What holiday tradition are you looking forward to the most? Family photo. Family photo. I am, that's all I talk about. Because finally we took a family photo last year. Because I realized last year that my camera had a automatic timer on it. And it was a new point shoot I got. And so we took a family photo. And it was like really awesome to finally have a photo of all of us. Not just one of us or some of us. Mom's always the one that takes it. So yeah, I'm looking forward to that. Especially since I just got my new camera. We're doing a family photo this year. 20. Is your Christmas tree real or fake? It's real! It's totally real this year. For the first time in like 10 years, we have a real tree. And it's really awesome. I think it's probably the last year we're going to do a real tree. Ever. Because now I, we remember why we stopped. It's just a lot of work and annoyance. 21. Do you like giving gifts or receiving? I like giving. Yeah, like, who would <laughs> like, I like getting gifts. I, I like giving love gifts. giving gifts. I, I like to see the, their face. Like, I like Especially if it's something you know they really, really, really Yeah, like, I worked really hard on my Secret Santa's gift, and I really can't wait to see their face. And I don't even know what I got my Secret Santa. <laughs> yeah, we do Secret Santa every year, well, almost every year. And it's a pretty fun tradition, and all four of us are doing it this year, and it's pretty exciting. It never happens. Yeah, it never happens that way. And it's not hard to figure out your person because there's only four of us, but it's pretty fun. I don't and then, know like, my person. I can't wait for them to see. I don't know anybody. 22, show us your tackiest Christmas attire. That would be cool if we had some. Yeah, well. I don't do that ugly Christmas sweater thing. Like, why would I want to wear an ugly Christmas sweater? And people pay like 30 bucks for like a sweater that's ugly. And even when we have those ugly holiday sweaters days at school, I just buy one of my friends. Yeah. I'd be mean, like, hey, you have an ugly sweater, can I borrow it? <laughs> and then I just don't it. Like, I don't. I don't know. 23. What would your dream place to visit for the holiday season? Perry. Perry. Like, we're on the same page for that. Like, uh, because well, she's already been there once. Yeah, France. I mean, everything I've ever seen, it looks really pretty for the holidays. So I would absolutely love to go there one time. Twenty-four. Does your family have a special holiday recipe you like to help make? Well, mom makes sweet potatoes, but she won't let anybody help. Yeah, mom makes really amazing pumpkin pie, but she's she's not gonna let us help make it. <laughs> That's her thing. She just does it. Yeah. But I really enjoy it. It's really good. Are we good? We're good. 25. Are you a pro rapper or do you fail miserably? Oh, you fail miserably. Um, There's sometimes I can do it. Yeah, I'm okay at Depending it. Depending on what it is. I wish I want to be one of those people that just make like beautiful wrapped creations, but mine fail. Like, I do okay sometimes, like, but if it's an odd shape though. If and one time I had to wrap it with something for Nick and it was really weird. I don't know, it was like this odd shape. Yeah. How'd it go? Really bad. Yeah, I can't wrap. Nick Watch opened it. it. It was like, how much tape did you need to be on this? <laughs> I hate when you try to wrap something and you, use to, you cut to the little paper and you have to like cut a whole new paper. I know. I did that for Sam. Uh, 26. Most memorable holiday moment. Oh. There's so many. I mean, uh, the holidays are always just really special. Um, you and I have the same st story, so you're gonna you should share it. You should share it. Oh, the RV? Yeah, I think the RV Christmas is The RV is Christmas is great. Um, we're at our grandparents. Yeah. And we stood out in the RV that I had. Yeah. Okay, our grandparents had a RV that we would travel and camp in every once in a while. But anyway, so one Christmas we decided, or our parents decided, that we would stay at our grandparents and just go ahead and have Christmas morning there. <laughs> so my siblings and I um, stayed in the RV. And that was really fun. Our grandfather stayed in there with us, and I guess our mom and grandma basically wrapped presents, I guess, overnight. But, like, it was really fun. Like, I know it sounds silly, but I enjoyed it. Yeah. There's something magical about 
being like at your grandparents' house. Yeah, and just waking up and going inside. It was something different. I had never spent our Christmas in the army. Yeah, that's unique. I think we ordered like pizza or something and just stayed in our grandparents' house really late until it was time to go to bed and then we went out and got in the RV. Oh yeah, my grandpa talked to me in that night. It was great. I know. It's very magical. It was really, really, really cold. <laughs> like I slept on the pull out table with an RV. Oh no, I slept on the bunk. Yeah, it was really, really, really cold. But I don't know, something was really magical about us waking up and already being at our grandparents' house. Like uh, seriously, it was magical. Yeah, his mom, dad, grandma were on his life. Yeah, I think I'll stay inside. We just got stuck out in the RV. Yeah. I don't know why we didn't just, just stay in the bedroom, I mean, but I guess she thought we might hear something. You guys stole. I guess his dad had a surgery. Remember? Our dad had just had surgery, and so our mom was taking care of him, but I don't know if that's why we stayed at our grandparents' house or not. I was a little too young to remember, but I just remember staying in the RV and it being like really cool. That was the best thing. I remember playing cards. Yeah, we were playing cards, and it was just like when we go camping. My favorite holiday memory. Oh, yes. Yes, is when I got my baby girl. Maybe okay. Okay, my favorite holiday memory, or one of them, one of my favorite holiday moments is this one. Yes. She was my Christmas present, so it was a pretty magical Christmas. I actually got her on Christmas Eve, and she was supposed to be my Christmas gift, but my mom couldn't wait any longer, so she took me to my grandparents' house where they were babysitting her, and I. But yeah, literally, that was the best Christmas present ever to get something I wanted a kitten so badly, and to be able to have her on Christmas Eve. It's pretty magical. And then I think I brought her out and showed you guys on yeah. Christmas. Oh, you did. You had a house coat on. And you said I'll be right back. I didn't think anything about it. I was playing with whatever I got for Christmas. But I was playing with something while you went to your bedroom and came back. And you sat down and your house coat was bigger. <laughs> her little head popped up like, hi. Yeah, she's always been like that. She is just like. It was adorable. Welcome to the party kind of kitty. I love her. And that was like the best Christmas present ever. And every Christmas I think about like I bought her, but she's so sweet. It's like my little Christmas baby, even though you were born like on Halloween. Alright, last question. Do you make New Year's resolutions and do you always stick with them? Mm. You, go, you first. go first. I go first. I'll okay. Um, I'm not really like obsessed over making resolutions because I most of the time just fail. Like I always make them, but like anybody else I fail at them. Um, but like it's always the same ones, be more organized. Eat healthier, yada yada yada. But I always, I don't pretty much keep them. But yeah, I made two resolutions this year, and I've officially accomplished both of them so far. Well, what have they been? Um, but uh, my first one was to stay true to who I am, and I have, and mm. I haven't changed for anybody. Yeah, and I think that's always important. You should always do that. And especially people. with everything that I've gone through this year, you know. Yeah, you always know people. Yeah, so <laughs> stay true to yourself. So. And the second one was to accept and love me for who I am and all my imperfections. Which I did. I actually realized Congrats. recently that I am beautiful. Aww. That's so sweet. You're cute. <laughs> <laughs> That's so, so sweet. Were, I was just like. Those were my two New Year's resolutions that I have actually kept this year. Good job, man. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm getting the really lame ones. <laughs> I was just like. We used to do this thing, we used to go to this little um, oh gosh. ceremony thing for New Year's and it was always like a spiritual thing and you always would like write down your one New Year's resolution or I think it was a resolution and it was really cool, they'd mail it to you in like December and you'd go in January obviously. Um, but you think about it a lot at first, you're just like oh yeah, you, like, you know, you just think about it and then like after a couple months you forget and then they send it to you in December and it's really funny to see it come in the mail and open it and be like oh wow yeah, like I don't know, it's pretty cool. But yeah, I think that is it for our tags. There have been a lot, and we have talked a lot. Because that's what I do. Yeah, we talk a lot. So, but that was really fun. It was fun. That was a lot of fun. We should do tags more often. No. Yeah. We should do like the sibling tags sometimes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, okay guys, that's it. Bye. What? <laughs> <laughs> it took her longer than I thought it would. She just taking the chair. That's my chair. She's been trying to take this chair like the whole video. It's your turn now. You good? Okay. Thank Bye, you. guys.
What was your favorite Xmas song? <laughs> it's really rude about Silent answer. Night, I guess. <laughs> I have no idea it's Silent Night, guys. She's <laughs> just leaping with all grumpy. Oh, hey! What are you taking on the app? What's your favorite holiday song? Nothing. Bah humbug. Yeah, I know. Shut up. Typical sad, you want my falls on her face. Hey, that's not the first time we've done that in a while. You just took a picture yesterday. I didn't know that. Okay. Claire's oh, was growing, growing my hair. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Are you good? <laughs> well, I'm like, sitting here falling over. Just be like, what the like, fuck hey, are you two doing? We're having an interview. Should I interview you? Because I'm close. <laughs> Only you. Okay. Ta. I'm gonna introduce you. <laughs> scavenger hunt and have Shit. clues. <laughs> what are you doing? Shut up with the trigger. You just don't like Sorry. I totally do do a scavenger. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, compose ourselves, we're not even on question two. I do do a sca- Oh yeah! <laughs> 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 Are you good? Hi baby! Shh. No, stop. I'm just gonna start talking while I walk back and I don't mind. I'm gonna fall off my chair. Cause I don't make hilarious video. Are you good? Can I talk? Progress. What happened? I thought we were having a moment. Camera, like, memory card. I'm trying to love you again. I love you. I love you. Just love Let us have a moment. Please. Okay. I... I pretty much wear... Christmas song? I don't know. Oh, there's so many. <laughs> okay. What is your favorite Christmas song? Honestly, like...